Kayol. Now we will know about description of bones. Structure of a long bone, what are the parts are there? Any long bone has upper end, lower end and shaft. Now the shaft is known as diaphysis. Shaft or body known as diaphysis. It forms from primary center of ossification. This one forms from the primary center of ossification. Now this shaft has a central medullary cavity and outer layer of a compact bone. These areas. Outer areas of a compact bone. Now medullary cavity. This medullary cavity is filled with red bone marrow in young individual and then it will be replaced with yellow bone marrow in older people. This color of the red bone marrow will be changed in older people into yellow. Now it is lined by endosteum here. It is this medullary cavity is lined by endosteum. Now the upper end and lower end are called as epiphysis. The upper end is named as proximal epiphysis. Lower end is named as distal epiphysis. Now an epiphysis develops from secondary center of ossification. This one forms from the primary center of ossification and both of the epiphysis will be formed from this secondary center of ossification. Now this is separated from diaphysis by a layer of hyaline cartilage called epiphyseal plate or growth plate. These two diaphysis and epiphysis they will be separated with a hyaline cartilage called epiphyseal plate or growth plate. Now both of these end upper end and lower end they both of them take part in the formation of joint. Now there will be a thin layer of hyaline cartilage lining the articular surface. In any long bone it will be there. Now basically this bone is externally lined by or covered by a layer of fibrous membrane. That one called is periosteum. A fibrous membrane will be there which will be covering the bone named as periosteum. Now in bone formation uh, this in any long bone the pus will be there. We have uh, we have discussed on this. We should know what are the parts are there in any long bone and we should remember this one. That in any long bone upper end or proximal epiphysis is there. Shaft or body or diaphysis is there. Lower end or distal epiphysis is there. And as I said about this bone marrow, endosteum, periosteum, you need to remember that. Thank you for watching the video till end. Share with your nursing friends and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.